All right, guys, so today we're going to be reacting to Mayako Mayako. I think is how you read it. She'll be reading the Campanella. Not an easy song. One of the least most well notorious song. Um, he was very well inspired by Paganini. This song is from Paganini's, uh, I think, Violin Concerto, the, pa the Campanella. Very beautiful song. If you haven't uh, listened to this song, go go listen to Liz Campanella uh, song and v uh, not Vivaldi, Paganini's original. We're just going to jump in. Let's see what's going on here. I'm, just, I'm not going to talk too much. Make sure you like, subscribe for any recommendation. Link in the description down below. Not, not in the description, just comment it down below. Let's go. Oh, hola. Cop copyright again. <laughs> oh, not easy jumps, man. She have a nice piano too. It's not easy, is it? Ooh. Huh, interesting. So the song Lost in the Garden by Love Bite was created by the motive of La Campanella. That's an interesting detail. Okay, that's a that's a that's a challenge. If you want to perform this, it's a challenge. We have to practice. Oh my god! Not an easy song, though. Okay, it's it's sounding it's sounding like it's making sense. It's sounding like it's making sense now. I'm going to try to film editing videos myself. I believe that skills improve with practice and dedication. It does, it does, it does. It's, everything's a skill, everything's a momentum, everything's like a muscle. She had the technique though. Even the video, the, the phone has a great sound. What? intimidating here mentally because a lot of your teachers have put these composers in a pedestal now i'm not saying it's a hard it's hard but we all can do it and I'm, I'm, i really mean it all 95 percent. if you really think about it the only reason we are intimidated by these people is composers because the teachers that we have have put these people in a pedestal that's the only reason they wrote the music they wrote everything for us to play. 
I can guarantee you, Beethoven, if Beethoven and Liszt were alive, they would be mad. With this kind of classical culture going on, they will be mad, super mad. There's so much arrogance, it's crazy. I don't want to get into it, but... Intimidation is here. She's side, side reading very well. Good tactic. That way you can just already practice with a mix. Good side reader, huh? Sarabadiba. Too much sharps. Yeah. Notice some of that double notes. He's, she's playing like this. Like this. Should be like this. See, you see my fingers? Should not be like this. Curve fingers, right? Right? That way you can always develop. First of all, it's a better tone, and the weight of the arm goes directly to your fingers. Also, you can improve technique. All, th all threes in one. She so has a great space between fourth and five. Very nice space. Good side reading, bro. Ain't gonna lie. There we go. She got in, she got the flow already. to think like that light heavy light heavy heavy um, bop. Da, 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 da. all arms arm in circular motion Listening. That's a very important line. That's the one that's going to lead you. Yeah, repeat it until you get it. Get it again. Yeah, get the feel of it. There you go. That left hand is messing up a little bit. 
There we go. That's a, that's a good technique to... Uh, there's a lot of technique to just make sure your your muscle memory stay. A lot of it has to do with repetition. Sometimes you have to do it a little fast, slower, rhythm, different rhythms, circular motions, right? You can practice with this. You can just make sure that wrist and arm and are separate sections. So the, you can do this first, then do this, and then all together kind of thing. That Make sure that your me muscle memory is it's already in your in your brain, yeah. She had a good space between four and five. That's gonna help her a lot. That's a little checkpoint. A little bit of that. To relax a little bit in that wrist. Silly thing. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it sounds sounds about right. There we go. You got it. I know it's difficult, but we have to get it through. Man, List, such a great composer. Respect. A little emoji. Hey, yes, yeah, start making sense now, yeah. Sounding much better. Nice job. Hey, hey, nice job. Hey, thank you for watching. I agree. Thank you. Nice job. Not an easy song, though. Not an easy song. This thing requires a lot of this wrist, a lot of this muscle right here. So you have to relax. A lot of that fingerprinting kind of action, right? A lot of this. So, and this motion a lot. Not this, right? A lot of this. And this. You see my, I don't know if you guys can see it, but here my tendons are moving with my muscle, which can create fatigue. 
for and this is something that I have recognized. Piano, classical piano requires a lot of muscle development beside the tendons. Because a lot of people say, no, you don't need your muscle. You need your muscles. And especially when it comes down to your hand, yes, we have muscles, especially with the thumb and the, and the pinky. These muscles are very important. Very important, right? If you don't have a, a very strong muscle and a flexible muscle, you cannot do drills, right? You cannot create, create a good sound. This muscle is very important. Because when you go under, under your fingers, see, right here, I'm activating that muscle. Eh? Especially in my fifth finger, when you're doing this kind of jumping, you're playing it like that. If you don't have a strong muscle, your fingers is not going to hold it. And remember, you're playing with your arm as well. So you have to create this nice motion, and your fingers have to carry that way. I learned a lot because I, I was watching arm wrestling, and they explain a lot of things that I, I was not, I was not aware of. Your hands have muscles. And your muscles are very important to develop in classical music. Go watch some of the classical musicians. Look at their hand. Their hand looks very muscly. That's all I have to say. Hey, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Let me know what. Let me let me know which song I should just react next. I will see you in the next one. I'm out. Peace.